Hi guys, welcome to Leftolium. I just got a question about uh, log files that's on um, Telegram, and it doesn't. I don't seem to have anything created just like that on YouTube yet. So what we did do, we did communicate about it, is that we do have log applications with a old F3. I can look for the word log. So this is an XFC menu that you see now, but it's left WM. And here we have the system log, like this. And here is information about XORG, XORG1, Pacman log things, last log and Calamaris log. So all this information is already available in this one. And then the other guy is logs. I'll just show you later on what it is important and all and applications and system and security and hardware so all these um, is available on your machine of course it's a graphical user interface to always the same thing files right so far and then log you'll find lots of things in here xorg pacman log last log calamaris log and maybe you're also interested in the x resources or the x session error things here there is a file sometimes with errors. So that's sometimes also interesting. Don't forget the D message, right? Pseudo D message thing. That's also something I'll go and have a look at and maybe do a grab in there like this. Find me Nvidia, for example, or Nvidia with a small N, it's all, it all matters. And then you learn something or maybe you don't but at least you you can figure it out. You're, you're independent and can find out what's happening to your machine. All right, so that's me about logging. The file, the file you need, um, the file you need is maybe easiest way to do is Control Shift D. Let's get Pamac running. Pamac Manager. What did I install on this machine in regards with log? So, what was it again? That might be an interesting one, uh, but no. Log, log, log. It's GNOME log anyway, so I know it starts with GNOME log. <laughs> Let's type this, otherwise we'll lose too much time. So GNOME log is one, and I believe there's another one that I've installed as well. Pseudo Pacman. Mine is remove gnome something. Let's see what we have. Gnome logs, gnome system log. So these are the two applications, the graphical applications that you just saw, gnome logs and gnome system log. Well, take your advantage with the information you receive through those applications and maybe you'll figure out what's bugging you or what's the trouble or how to solve it. All right, cheers.